Hi everyone, it is Danny, your scrapper on the street, and we made it to day eight of Low 213. And I feel extremely mean today because I know a lot of you up in the northeast are getting hit with a blizzard this weekend, and I'm here in Florida wearing a tank top and flip flops today. And I thought about that just a little bit ago when I was reading on the discussion boards how we were all preparing for the blizzard, and I was like, hmm. So I apologize for that, but it's sunny and beautiful here in Florida, so come on down and visit your scarper on the street. So day eight, we had a focus on smell, and I went with food. It's pretty, food's an important part of my family traditions and our lives, so it was an easy thing to do, food. Um, I had a couple of other things cross my mind, but none that I felt as passionately about and none that I had the coordinating pictures for. So I went with food and I went with Christmas food because I was just at my parents this year for Christmas and we have our Christmas traditions and our Christmas foods. So I had a lot of fun with the title. I've been going crazy with these bigger, longer titles, and the more you encourage me, like you Heidi, I know you're out there watching, um, the more I've been playing with these big titles, and so I did that today, and I just had it in my head that I wanted to do a play on It's Beginning to Look a Lot Like Christmas, and make it It's Beginning to Smell a Lot Like Christmas, and it took me the longest part of this layout today was to find enough letters in my stash to spell out this long title. Um, I have a lot of black letters but obviously that wouldn't have worked today so that was probably the longest part of today's layout and I really am happy with how it turned out considering I did like the worst thing you could do. I glued down my layers and my pictures before I placed the title before I even knew what letters I was going to use so it was a very fortunate thing that everything fit just perfectly. And then I created a little cluster in the corner um, using some glitter buttons that came in that same packet um, that I talked about the pearls yesterday. These buttons came in their own little container. I have them here. And I thought they tied in nicely with the green glitter letters. So I kind of wanted to make it a little more cohesive. And then I used the musical note snowflake because I did do a play on a song and so even though we're focusing on smell doesn't mean I can't tie the rest of the page into music as well. And I kept put my journaling here. I'm a big fan of black cardstock and white journaling or just white journaling on a darker page as a whole. So I just feel like the white pens write really nice. So, I mean, that's just a personal preference, but I am a big fan of it. And I talk about how on Christmas morning, my mom wakes up and the first thing she does is gets her sauce back on the stove simmering and she starts frying up the meatballs. And while we're opening presents, the whole house just smells of like frying meatballs. And then she brings us all one and it's just like really a magical thing. So that smell of frying meat. <laughs> is Christmas to me and it may be silly and it may be strange but we Italians we like to eat no matter what time it is and it's never too early for meatball. So there you have it today's layout and as usual there will be a close-up picture of this layout below this video here on uh, scrapperonthestreet.com and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye!